Are you looking for a thorough Thrive Cart review? If so, you're in the right place because in this video, I'll be telling you the pros, cons, and alternatives to Thrive Cart. So if you're in the market for a shopping cart software and you're wondering whether or not Thrive Cart is the right option for you, then stay tuned. If we haven't met before, hey there, my name is Tiffany Domina and I'm the founder of HowToEntrepreneur.com where we talk about how to start and grow businesses from idea to full-time income and from full-time income to enterprise. So if you haven't yet, definitely subscribe to this channel and click the bell icon so you can be notified of upcoming videos. So if you've seen those software like QuickBooks or you've seen PayPal, how you can send out invoices when you have a product or a service that you want to sell, um, then you know what it's like to invoice and the process of collecting money that way. But with Thrivecart, you can actually set up shopping cart pages on your website and you can collect payment online without invoicing. And this can be really cool because you can automate your sales process and actually cut time and make things much more efficient. So the company Thrivecart was founded in 2016 by Josh Bartlett and it's grown to have a raving community of avid fans and this is kind of how I noticed Thrivecart because I saw lots of reviews and I saw other people who said positive things about it and so I decided to try it out. Now the software is really robust, um, it's hosted a hosted solution so you don't actually have to have your own domain name in order to use Thrivecart but it's definitely recommended that you um, have some other website or means for sending people from um, a page where you've warmed them up and then to a shopping cart page. So um, it is full of lots of features that help you to sell online in a professional and in a credible way. So how does Thrivecart work? With Thrivecart, you input your product or service catalog, you choose your pricing and payment options. They have options that you can choose from like one time, pay what you want, subscription or split pay. And then you can customize your shopping cart pages and begin selling your products or services online. I wanna go back and talk about these different options that they have. The one time payment is where you can have people pay um, the amount that you want all at one time but the pay what you want can be used for so much more than accepting donations or something like that you can use that for tips you can use that for custom product projects so for example maybe you own a a business like a general contracting business or a business like a marketing agency where you find yourself doing quite a bit of services that are custom you can set up a custom pay what you want page where people can go and pay the um, the amount that you've quoted to them and that can cut down some time that you might um, you might have um, you can also have like like I mentioned before subscriptions and include it with the subscriptions Thrivecart has the dunning process and if you haven't or aren't familiar with dunning Basically what it is, is um, when you have a membership, sometimes the payments may not go through and the dunning process means that even if the payments don't go through, Thrivecart will go back and continue to remind the person and re-attempt payment um, before, so that you can capture your revenue. So with, the, um, with Thrivecart, you have to connect it to like an email marketing software in order for that to be super effective because then you will be able to use your email marketing software to notify the customer hey the payment didn't go through um, we will be reattempting in three days or whatever the case is but that's also a feature that's included in Thrivecart that's super awesome um, and then finally split pay so if you have maybe a higher ticket product maybe your product is over a thousand dollars and you want to give people the option of being able to pay in in parts so maybe you want to split it into three or four payments um, then you can allow that through split pay and Thrivecart will collect the payments up until 
it's paid in full and you can also set up the dunning for that process as well so thrivecart will keep analytics for you so you'll know how many people are visiting your shopping cart pages the conversion rate and the lifetime customer value you can also manage an affiliate program inside of thrivecart so you can invite affiliates one cool thing is you can import affiliates so if you may have had affiliates on a different software or platform then you can actually import those affiliates into thrivecart um, you can customize each of your affiliates experience so maybe you are selling products that are across different niches on your thrivecart account you can make it where affiliates that are in this niche have access to promote certain products and affiliates of another niche might have access to promote different products so you can also customize their affiliate account by giving certain affiliates different commissions than others this might be beneficial if you know that certain ones are heavily influential or that they have a history of selling lots of products that are similar to your niche you can increase the commission percentage to incentivize those super affiliates or highly influential people to promote your products or services um, you can have different commission rates for each product or service and monitor the number of clicks the number of conversions and more so that's also another nice feature that's included inside of thrivecart um, another thing is thrivecart integrates with quite a few things and this can be really cool for you as well so thrivecart integrates with leading payment processors leading email marketing services membership services webinar software and um, different product fulfillment platforms and Zapier so with the payment processors you can integrate with Stripe PayPal Apple Pay Google Pay and authorize.net um, to collect payment with email marketing you can integrate with ConvertKit, active campaign and fusionsoft entreport hubspot mailchimp drip moosend aweber get response mailer light and cindy and with the membership software you can integrate with kajabi member press lifter lms teachable member press member mouse optimize member and thrive apprentice and for notifications you might want to use google sheets or slack you might also want to to integrate google sheets for exporting reports and things like that um, and then for fulfillment you can integrate with services like Vervante, Printful, Lulu, Kanaki, Pabli, and other places so that you can white label products or various things. So when people check out from your shopping cart pages, you can actually um, have the orders fulfilled and warehoused and everything um, directly from your Thrivecart account. Um, when it comes to webinar software, maybe you want to sell paid webinars and so you have people who check out through um, through Thrivecart and it can automatically integrate to Demio so that you can deliver your, your service or your product, your paid webinar through Demio. And then you have Zapier which makes it opens up a whole lot of other doors where you can connect to CRM, you can connect to accounting, um, you can connect to other memberships or course software that doesn't directly connect to Thrivecart. So for example, I've connected Zapier and Podia to Thrivecart. Um, you can connect other email services, other webinar services, other fulfillment services, community software or forums, and lots of other things so who is thrivecart best for from my observation i've seen thrivecart used mostly for small businesses and people with smaller teams it's perfect for digital product based businesses who deliver their products or services through virtual events memberships a learning management software or other product fulfillment solution um, Thrivecart doesn't deliver files, courses, or products of any type. It's solely designed to accept payment and to increase order value. 
So you would have to, if you wanted to sell something like a course or something like that, you would have to have a place where that course is hosted outside of Thrivecart. Um, Thrivecart has always, has ways to input various payment options, but it might not have all the features a retail physical product business might want. So if you sell products where you need lots of customization options on the checkout page, like if you need things like size, color, custom messages, or something like that, you might feel like you have to do too many workarounds with Thrivecart, and that's where something else that's suited more for retail might work better for you. Um, for service-based businesses, it's best for those who are okay with doing their estimates, proposals, and quotes prior to using the checkout software. So if you are okay with having your customers come to you and you do the estimate or um, that part of the process and then you have them check out on your checkout pages, then it can work well for a service-based business. Um, if you have like packages already outlined, then it can be perfect for a service-based business. So for example, if you are an accountant and you have a, a, a annual tax package then something like that will be perfect to sell through Thrivecart because it's not it doesn't need too much customization it's something lots of people can go and check out and pay for um, and if you have something that's more custom or tailored like if you have an accounting package that's for enterprise level businesses that have several locations and all of that stuff, that's where you may want to use something like the pay what you want or something like that feature in order to um, allow those that variation from the basic package. For nonprofits or fundraisers, the software can be used to collect donations. So that pay what you want feature would be perfect for collecting donations or raising funds. Unfortunately, if you want it to offer pay what you want subscription options, the software isn't able to do that at the time of this video. So for for some software, like I did a, a, um, a, I did a couple other reviews on shopping cart software, and some of the software will allow you to do a recurring pay what you want um, amount, but Thrivecart doesn't have that feature right now. Businesses who accept a large amount of revenue through tips can use the pay what you want feature to accept tips. You can input specified tip amounts, but like I said, the um, the software doesn't have the ability to do recurring. If, if you wanted to, uh, for some reason, do recurring um, donations or something like that, and they get to pay what they want on a recurring basis, you'd have to kind of set up different payment amounts and have them deducted on a specified, uh, at a specified period of time. And, um, Let's say you decide you want to sell your service or sell your product and you want to upsell a tip. Um, the software does not have, does not have the capability to upsell a pay what you want. So like if you sold, um, like let's say I sell web design services and I sell my web design service and I want to be able to upsell a tip. I would have to input a specific amount like to upsell a $10 tip or upsell a $20 tip or something like that, but it doesn't have the upsell pay what you want feature. So um, you have to follow up via email or social media or some other way to upsell a pay what you want. Um, the software is capable of processing lots of transactions without fail. So I've seen people use the software to process millions of dollars in sales. And I did lots of research to verify that that was possible. So if you're concerned about whether it can handle the volume that you need, then I believe that for most people, it'll definitely suffice. I haven't seen Thrivecart used as commonly for mid-sized or large companies like teams with 100 team members or more. So that's something I, I just haven't seen, but it is possible that there's companies out there using it for that. 
Um, if you are a company that has a team of a hundred or more, um, then I'd say to look into it and possibly reach out to the Thrive Cart support and see how much um, support they have for enterprise level accounts like yours. Um, there are limitations with how many admin users can use the account. I believe for the pro account, it is five, but it might still be workable if you reach out to the development team. So if you need to have more than five admin account users, um, then you have to do some workaround or talk to the development team to get that access. But overall, I recommend Thrivecar for small businesses with small teams who would be using it. Um, now, does Thrivecar offer tools or training? They do have tutorials, um, tutorial videos attached within various parts of the membership area or the members area. So when you're setting things up, you can refer to the tutorial for help. They also have a knowledge base and help articles that have been really helpful for me to use the software. And I would say that um, they will probably be really helpful for you as well. Um, does Thrivecart have good customer support? According to the customers, the customer support is responsive and polite. They offer tech support through their ticketing system and community support through their Facebook group. For most customers, the Facebook group and the ticket support seems to be sufficient. When I've looked around at other reviews or looked around at other Thrivecart users, a lot of them rave about the support from Thrivecart. So you'll see their customer satisfaction rating is, is fairly high when you look in most places. But for me personally, I think that um, their support hasn't been the easiest to use. I would say that um, coming from Samcart, Samcart had um, more involved support. Um, I actually had a, a, an account manager that I could schedule appointments with at any point in time and meet with. So that I would say that Thrivecart support, it hasn't met up to the standard that I had from Samcart. However, for most of the customers, they do seem to be satisfied with the amount of support that there is. Unfortunately, they don't offer any priority support options. So you don't have live chat, you don't have phone support or other options that you might want if there was an emergency issue. So if you are looking for something that has more quicker um, and priority support options, then Thrivecart may not be the best option for that. Now, what does Thrivecart do? Well, Thrivecart has high customer satisfaction ratings. They've added features consistently, so you'll see reviews that are outdated because of Thrivecart's consistent development. A lot of the reviews will say that they don't have this feature, they don't have that feature, and they're actually not valid anymore because Thrivecart has been very aggressive with adding their features. Um, they created a software that enables you to sell unlimited numbers of products or services and this is really cool because a lot of shopping cart um, competitors a lot of thrive carts competitors like click funnels and kajabi and others they actually have a limit to how many products you have to sell before you have to upgrade your plan with thrive cart you can have an unlimited amount of checkout pages an unlimited amount of products that you can sell and it's so much that you can do and then they have the lifetime pricing right now so this is really a steal right now in my opinion um, they also don't charge processing fees so when you have shopping carts like Shopify or others that charge a processing fee per transaction in addition to what you would pay to PayPal or Stripe or other payment processors, then that can really add up. But with Thrivecart, there are no processing fees. So you only have to pay the amount that you would to PayPal or Stripe. There's also no subscription or ongoing payments. And this is really a great benefit in comparison to like Sam Card or other shopping carts that charge a monthly subscription that can be a huge savings in the long run um, with Thrivecart. 
And then the software, the software rivals with the features of leading shopping cart software. A lot of the upsell, downsell, order bump features that are in ClickFunnels or that are in SamCart are also in ThriveCart and it's much more of an affordable price. It's a lifetime price, um, but you can get a lot of those features for that one price. Um, ThriveCart is simple to use. When I purchased the pro account, I was able to really hit the ground running, set up my products, and begin making sales within days. Um, they provide detailed analytics, even per product, so you can actually look at how many views, how much, how the conversion rate is for each product that you have listed inside of your ThriveCard account. And they're updating the software regularly, so that is another huge part now in terms of what they don't do well they don't have the pay what you want subscription option so if you are looking for like maybe if you're a church and you're looking for um, an option where you can allow people to donate and then commit to a specific donation amount then that is something that you might have to look elsewhere for because that's not an option right now inside of Thrivecart. Um, you can't upsell, pay what you want. Um, so if you wanted to be able to like upsell tips or something like that, if that is a significant part of your business model, then that is something you would have to work, create a workaround for because that's not something that's currently available. And like I said, they don't offer the priority customer support option. So there is no phone support number or a live chat option that you can reach out to if you had any questions or something like that. The benefit with Thrivecart is that it's very easy to use. They do have the knowledge base. They do have a, a um, Facebook group. So all of these things are available for you. They do have a customer support email and ticketing system, and that's really what you have to use. Another thing is, um, if you are looking for a software that that um, offers payment processors like Amazon Pay, then that is not included with ThriveCart. So these are the things that I would say um, are not included, but it, it doesn't take away from the fact that it's really an awesome software, especially for the lifetime pricing. Now, what do other customers say about ThriveCart? Now, if you're considering ThriveCart, you might want to hear more than just my opinion about it. So I wanted to gather some customer experiences for you so that you can evaluate whether this is a good fit for you. So here are some positive and some negative reviews about ThriveCart. In terms of the positive, um, Navid Moazes says, I actually use ThriveCart and it's been working for me to process multiple six figures in sales on just ThriveCart alone since I started using it. It's not 100% perfect, although it's quite close, but it serves me and should serve you well. Um, right now, there's no better cart available uh, okay, so Ian Brody, founder of ianbrody.com, says right now there's no better card available for small businesses and marketers. It's available on such on a special one-off lifetime license. Laura, the founder at lovetolaunch.com, says I use it on all my launches, recommend it to all my students who also rave about it. And the only time I've needed to contact support are to understand some of the more advanced functions that I want to experiment with. It has been such a reliable tool for me. And when you're running big launch campaigns, you need reliability to give you confidence and speed. The last thing I want to be doing during a launch is worrying about whether my checkout pages are going to work. And she's right about that. And then Gail Bret Breton Co-founder at Authority Hacker, he said, despite being one of the newer carts on the market and despite not even being publicly released yet, ThriveCart is already a very worthy contender for the top spot. 
Um, Miles Beckler from milesbeckler.com said, if you want a professional level shopping cart that can handle multiple six figures in transactions each year, but you don't want to have a recurring monthly fee and you want the ability to create a variety of upsell funnels, downsell funnels, bump offers, etc., get Thrivecart today before they switch from the lifetime license to a monthly pricing model. In terms of the negative Thrivecart reviews, um, it's actually really difficult to find them. I didn't find very many negative Thrivecart reviews. Instead, I found like comments that people made where they said things like the cart doesn't have many customization options or reviews where they were there was a competing cart that was being promoted, but none demonstrate like the lack of customizations or clearly say that Thrivecart isn't a good product. So that's good to know if you are looking into purchasing Thrivecart yourself. Um, in terms of the customizations, I've experimented with them and I believe that they have a lot of customization options, especially in comparison to other shopping cart softwares out there. I mean, you can change the colors, you can change the layouts, you can add in different widgets, drag and drop. Um, so I believe it's very customizable um, in contrast with other shopping carts. Now, you might be asking how much does Thrivecart cost? And this is actually one of the greatest benefits of Thrivecart is that it's currently being offered at a one-time lifetime license for $4.95 and the pro account is $609. So they've been talking about changing their pricing model for quite a bit of time and I'm not sure when they actually plan on implementing that, but right now they still have the lifetime license offer. I mean, I've seen mention of them changing to a subscription model all over the internet um, on each post that I read, each review. Um, and even on their website, you can see that they've been thinking about changing to a recurring subscription model for quite some time. So I would not wait if you are on the fence and you really think this is a good, um, suitable option for you. I would definitely jump on it because who knows when they'll be changing that. Now, my final opinion, I started using Thrivecart in November of 2020. And that was after almost six months of using SamCart and experience using other checkout solutions, including Lead Pages, Podia, and others. And I really enjoyed the SamCart software, but when an affiliate of Thrivecart introduced me to Thrivecart, I actually found it easier to use. The checkout pages are more customizable, and this is my opinion. And the features that come with Thrivecart require you to be on the $199 a month plan. And so to get the affiliate um, the affiliate portal and to get the dunning for memberships and all of that, you have to be on the highest level plan with SamCart and that's $199 per month. And so that is actually three months of um, three months of SamCart's highest plan is equal to paying for the li lifetime license for Thrivecart. So when looking at it, it's like, do you want the Dunning features? Do you want the affiliate program features? Do you want the unlimited checkout pages and all of that? Um, if you want all of that, the $609 price is really, really um, <laughs> a steal in comparison to others like ClickFunnels or SamCart and what they offer for $600. So I've been able to lower my cost significantly by making the switch to Thrivecart um, because at the $200 per month plan, I'd be paying $2,400 per month, I mean per year annually on SamCart, but by switching to Thrivecart, I can pay $609 in one year and start to get a return on that right away. And so I haven't lost functionality from what I can see yet, um, one thing I haven't fully been able to test and verify is whether or not my conversion rates are the same. So I'm not quite sure yet if SamCart checkout pages convert better 
than Thrive Cart checkout pages. I don't expect that to be a difference, um, but it is something that I'm still in the middle of testing. So, um, some features that I really like about Thrive Cart that I didn't have with Sam Cart include the embeddable shopping carts, the pop out carts, the stats per product. And then there's more features inside of the affiliate center, like custom commissions, more detailed analytics, and better A-B testing functionality. So if you are looking for a shopping cart software that's robust, that competes with the leaders in the market while also having more affordable, um, while also being more affordable, Thrivecart is definitely a great option. Um, and I would say you should get the Thrive Cart license while the lifetime offer is still available. Now, Thrive Cart does, there are some amazing competitors um, in the shopping cart space. And so if you have watched this video and you've seen that some of the cons are like, you know, really important for you, like maybe the support is really, really important for you, or maybe um, the the subscription model is really really important for you then these are some of the alternatives that that I would recommend you take a look at definitely take a look at Sam cart Sam cart in my opinion is the closest with having um, parallel features with thrive cart Sam carts um, development team is very aggressive with making new features and all of those things there's also a, a radical group of uh, fans of Sam Cart. The founders provide a lot of education um, and to their to their members. So I was able to get courses and different things like that included when I signed up with Sam Cart. Like I said, I had an account manager who I could schedule appointments with at any point in time, and it was kind of like coaching because they would work with me and give me advice on how I can attract more people to my sales pages and things like that. So that was really um, awesome. My experience with the support at SamCart was really awesome. With Podia, um, they have, oh my goodness, great support. And they have a software that includes the shopping cart with their core software. And you can use it to, to sell various different products and services. Now, Podia, I believe, is best at um, selling the courses and the product or being a hosting solution for those things. I think that some of the like analytics and um, shopping cart features are not as advanced as what you would find in something like Thrivecart or Samcart, but they do have a shopping cart um, with lead pages. They have um, a shopping cart that's built in. You can integrate it with Stripe, but you don't have the upsell, downsell features like that. Um, the dunning for the memberships, all of that is not included with that. ClickFunnels has a comparable solution with upsells and downsells. Um, Russell Brunson is the founder, and he has quite a bit of education and different things that comes along with ClickFunnels. There's a huge community of ClickFunnels users, you'll find lots of YouTube videos and various things to help you along the way if you decide to go with that option. So um, Shopify, if you have more of a retail store um, or you need more retail functionality, like maybe you have customization um, that you need, need to offer your customers, um, then maybe Shopify might be a good option for you, Kajabi, um, if you're looking for an all-in-one solution for courses, webinars, other things, um, Kajabi or Kartra might be a good option for you. And lastly, Teachable, if you're looking for a solution to sell um, courses and to sell coaching and things like that, Teachable could be a good option for you. Now, SamCart, ClickFunnels, and ThriveCart really are the most advanced of all of the, um, and Shopify, really are the most advanced of all of the options, the alternatives that I presented in terms of having lots of 
upsell, downsell, order bumps, analytics, and all of those things available to maximize your order value. Um, so my verdict in terms of Thrivecart, I definitely recommend Thrivecart. If you are looking for a shopping cart solution to help automate your sales process, definitely take a look at it. Um, they have high customer satisfaction ratings, no ongoing subscription, robust features consistent with the market leaders, upsell, downsell, dunning functionality. Um, you can accept one-time payments, subscriptions, pay what you want payments, and split pay. And so those are the main things that you should keep in mind when you are looking at Thrivecart. So I really hope this review was helpful for you. If it was, please leave a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more reviews like this or more videos like this where I do product and service reviews as well as growth strategies to help you grow a business from idea to full-time income and from full-time income to enterprise, then definitely subscribe to this channel and click the bell icon below so you can be notified of upcoming videos. That's all I have for this video and I really hope to see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye.